What is going on, my AP Human Geography e-learning students? It is Mr. Majewski here. Uh, and I wanted to check in with everybody um, uh, because of the unique situation that we are all experiencing here in relation to the COVID-19 coronavirus situation. Um, and so I wanted to give a number of you guys updates as to uh, what's happening, uh, because obviously beyond all the other reasons where, where this affects us, this has an impact on AP and our AP exams as well. That's not as important, but obviously it's something that I know some of you are at least thinking about, so I wanted to touch bases on it. So first off, hello, and I hope everybody is doing okay. Um, I want you all to know that I am here for you for any support that you might need, whether that is in this class, in another class, or just outside of school altogether. Um, I hope you would never hesitate to reach out. That's why I am here. Uh, I am safe. I am good. I hope all of you are as well. I am at home uh, working alongside the girlfriend who's also here um, working remotely from home as well. Um, so as you guys are aware, um, we are officially off for two weeks, right? This week uh, and then the spring break week, although all indications are that we will be out longer. They haven't officially told us that yet. When they do, you will be amongst the first to know because I will be reaching out to you guys right away to let you know that. Um, it looks like we're going to be out for a longer extended period of time. Nobody knows how long that is. Um, what I've been told right now is that it's business as usual for the e-learning classes. So we just continue to operate as if nothing is different uh, since we're already used to the e-learning format. So I have gone ahead and posted the week 29 work. Now it's 29 and 30. I'm not making this due until after we come back from spring break. So you actually have two weeks to work on it, including the spring break week. Um, but hey, it's regular stuff. It's regular credit with regular assignments. So you need to do this. It's not like your other classes that are enrichment, right? Because we're still operating as usual, particularly because we're an AP class. Why? Well, because the AP tests, as we know it right now, are still going on. College Board sent an email out yesterday saying they're going to actually allow kids to test from home virtually using computers. Um, and the exam is still going to happen. It might be a little later than it was scheduled, but it's still going on at least for now. And so we have to be full steam ahead. Not because we're e-learning, but because we're an AP e-learning class. And so for us, we're one of the last groups in the state uh, where timetables matter. And so we have to continue to plug away. I actually kind of think it's a good thing in some regards because it allows us to really just focus in on our work um, and kind of ignore some of the static, some of the noise that's happening around us. Now, hey, the benefit of the assignments this week is that you have two weeks to do them. I have to get some late or missing work in from some of you. Uh, it's desperation moment for many of you. A number of you are well over 100%. You're good, all right? You're golden. I'm talking about the folks that are low, low Fs. We need some work. I got to get that work into you. This is the perfect opportunity for you to be getting some of these assignments in. You must let me know, though, because remember, I don't get notifications uh, when an assignment is turned in late through Schoology. So I have to hear from you that you have submitted an assignment. All right. Some heads up. Uh, we're supposed to get an announcement from the governor today about possible changes to the um, state educational policies as of right now. Um, pay attention to that. Um, Thursday or Friday, we're going to get an announcement supposedly from the district um, as to whether there will be any extensions announced or anything like that. Pay attention to that, please. All right. Um, as is the case with anything, uh, I'll be your number one notifier. You guys will be amongst the first to know no matter what happens because um, you have a lot more writing on this than most other students do. Um, and again, I need you to focus on this class, on your AP classes. Uh, because these are the classes where you're actually getting assignments that are being valued, that are counting, that are mattering. Uh, your other classes, you're getting enrichment activities, uh, which is essentially just bonus stuff, right, that you're not required to do. Um, so with that in mind, uh, a couple of last-minute things, or last-second things, I should say. Um, you need to get these chapter guides in. I, I give you one chapter guide for this two-week interval. It's, it's the 11-2 chapter guide. I know you guys don't love doing these, but we got to get them done. Uh, also, I have a video explanation of what your assignments are this week, all right? It is located 
uh, right here, summary of assignments. Go, go ahead and watch that so you understand what it is that you need to do. Finally, uh, when we come back from spring break, I will be scheduling some Zoom meetings, right? Meetings online uh, where we will be getting together as a class to have some 20, 30 minute meeting times. Uh, that'll be one, once or twice a week just to check in on everybody. Uh, so please anticipate getting some invitations from me towards the end of spring break. Hey, any questions, any problems, email or send me a message through Schoology. I'm here for you folks. Um, and I'm super appreciative and thankful for every one of you. I'm super thankful for all of you who have been plugging away at the work. Um, and for those of you who have not, um, now is your time to shine. All right. Anything I can do for you, let me know. Mr. M signing out.